I gotta go a little faster, I had no speed. Which faster is scarier though, because when you go faster, you start falling. Alright, let's try it again. Oh! <laughs> What's going on guys? Welcome back to another scooter video. Today we're up here at Stoke Run, but they've got some new ramps over here on the side, right over there. And they also got the outdoor section nice and clean because it's not raining today, unlike last time, which it was super pouring rain. We're going outside. Evan's gonna start us out, out here with a nice tasty line. And oh, I'm filming while he's going. I don't, he was ready, I was not ready. Anyways, he's gonna get a nice little line out here and I'm gonna put you guys on my head and we're just gonna have some fun. There's a sweet hip over there. And then this crazy wall right section. Definitely gonna try to hit that again today. We're gonna start the mini flip challenge. Maybe I'll start doing that in every single video, but right here, I've got a nice little mini flip on this hip. You don't think I got it? Come on, I'm gonna show them. I'm gonna get it right here. You didn't see no foot. Yeah, I did. No, you didn't. I told you. Talking smack. <laughs> hey, you gonna back me up now? Just then. Oh no! You good? Yeah. You know what it was? It's because you told me I didn't have the flip. That was some payback. We are gonna hit a rail. Ooh, and a down rail. I am so street. I'm pooped. It's been a long day. We went to all day yesterday at Tanga, and now I'm just so tired from riding there. Super sick. There's an indoor section, and it has a foam pit and a resi, and basically we just spent all day on the foam pit and resi because we don't have anything like that anywhere near us. So getting to hit that, we had to take full advantage of it. But let's let's try to liven up a little bit and see what's cracking out here. We'll get the whip drop. I'm gonna come up here and do a little bar manny, and we'll get a barn. Oh, I'm gonna go back to the rail. I so could have added a whip out of that. Dude, that is the steepest little quarter pipe ever. Woo, first G. All right, let's go back to that little mini. Follow safe zone. You guys already know I love the half pipes. Let's hop right in here. Oh, no. <laughs> oh, no. I had to make Evan not feel so bad. When I said I was tired, I was not kidding. I'm absolutely dead right now. We're gonna turn it around. It'll it'll click. Let's try that again. Yeah. Ah, mini floor. <laughs> All right, Cody, what you got? <laughs> oh yeah. I thought small quarter for that. What is your Instagram, sir? Uh it's Cody Exists on Instagram. Cody exists. Hey, Dawson, I'm no, Dawson. Slap that on the screen right there. I really want to hit a stall on that thing and then hop back in. So afraid to go over there. I think we're good enough. I always get a little nervous when doing uh either wall rides or just you know like fence stalls because First of all, the fence has to be strong enough, but then also you gotta make sure you have the right speed so you don't go all the way over it. Oh, that's scary. Oh, but then getting back in, that's the scary part. And that fence moved a little bit. I don't know if you can see this, but like it goes whoa, whoa, whoa. I wanna hit it. Alright, let's get this. There we go, dude. Excuse me. Do you like my hand play that thing? It's such a quick wall, right? You just go up and you just like hand play. <laughs> All right, I've been talking about this, this little wall right thing over here for a while. We gotta work our way over to here. I think we just like kind of cruise up onto it, get the speed for it, then we kind of hop onto this thing. Holy cow, that's a lot of speed. All right, we're calling ourselves a line here. We're gonna hit a little buttercup on this hip over here. We're gonna link it through, wall ride, and we're gonna come back up. And I'm gonna try to do this upright right here. 
All right, one part done. Let's get some speed for this. Yay. And now let's see if we can do the upper rail. We got it, first tee. Okay, I think we should probably head back inside. What transition should we do to go back inside? And we're back inside now. And actually it's completely empty. There's literally no one here right now. So we've got the whole skate park to ourselves. Let's get into it. things cooking out on this step up right here so I'm gonna take the roundabout way we're basically just going all the way around the skate park here and then we're gonna cruise through here get some speed this is like the best way to go to get speed on this thing and then we hit these little bowl corners and then we're like perfectly lined up really step up yeah that's a good step up too actually I'm not even gonna act like I know the name for tricks so whatever that is we just did it and then whatever that one is we just did it as well let's do a couple little jibs on this little guy a little front feeble, 270, no 180, oh, try it again, front side, there it is, let's see what we do up it, let's get a mani, to whip, let's do a little stall to nose manual, Woo. all right, we're going to try a 50-50 to heel whip out, oh, we stuck it, you know what's next, we got to try the front side 50-50 to whip out, Yo. All right, let's try a Feeble to Smith. Maybe 180. Feeble, Smith, 180. Yoo-hoo. Although I feel like I could add a bar into that. Smith. No, 180 bars would be so scary. Smith, dude, throw the bar. Feeble, Smith, dude, throw your bar spin. We're gonna throw the bar this one, I swear. Feeble, Smith. Yes. That was it. That should not have been as hard as it was, but that was difficult. I just don't do a lot of like down ledges or ledges or rails, but this is fun. Let's do one last one on here. Dude, that would be insane. I'm gonna try this front side 50 50. Fakey. Oh, we got into it. Okay. I gotta go a little faster. I know speed. Which faster is scarier though, because when you go faster, you start falling. Oh! oh that was so hard. Oh. See, like, I'm getting on it, but I'm just like locking that front into it. Oh, dude, these new wheels. So we release these, they're half white, half black, and when they spin, they look insane. All right, let's try this again. Oh, no, nope, that was stupid. Dude, oh, missed it. Oh, that was it, what am I doing? Nope. Oh. Dude. No. Nope, nope, bump it up. All right, now we got this. We're taking that. Woo, that was hard. That's for like 20 tries on that. Oh, dude, you can jump down this ramp still. Oh my gosh, my back wheel, as soon as I hit the ground, it just slipped. I even landed straight. Yeah. Light work. Like it was nothing. He was nervous to do that. Come on. Jumping back, jumping back. Ah, oh, yeah. Like it was nothing. All right, Evan just made a really good point. We haven't even filmed anything on the new half pipe yet in the corner. So I'm gonna hit this gap over here and then we're going straight for the half pipe. Nope. We did a whip, no invert, that's okay. We're moving on to the uh, the mini ramp over here. This thing is super, super cool because it's like matches the whole rest of the park with the skate light and everything. But it's like a nice little standard three foot, nice quarters and everything. Coping sticks out a little bit far, but you can really lock into things. But it sticks out a little far for my liking personally, but it's still, uh, you can, I bet Roller Blades probably love this, probably lock in for days. We're about to do a handshake. We're gonna hop up here. We're gonna invent our own handshake. I'll do a front side feeble, high five, and now hop back in. Oh, whoa, whoa. Go back. Missed me. Oh, okay. Oh, we got a little knuckle on that one, didn't we? Nice tasty salad right there. He's gonna try his first 50-50. Oh, dude, just get that front wheel on. You so could do that. Just lean into the ramp and you'll you'll be solid. I'd rather lean 
You can use your heels if you do that. You can kind of like cheat a little bit. Less speed. You had too much speed. You like aired. If you guys ever know you can't lock into the 50 50, it's probably because you didn't. You went too fast. Oh, see, there's the 50 50. Now you just gotta keep your head, you know, like right there in the ramp. Getting there. Getting there. Oh. Keep your weight inside the ramp, and you can so get that. Whoa, double tire ride. He's just straight stepping it up here. I would say less speed, actually. Do you like you're doing a feeble? Just cruise, cruise up to it. If you go too fast, it actually makes it hard because then you're like airing. Yes. Oh, with the rodeo one-hander, let's go. Back it up, back it up, make it count. <laughs> that hand. Clean as a whistle. Let's go. Knocking out new learns. All right, we're gonna try something cool. Evan just came up with this idea. He's gonna do a 50-50 on the lower one, and I'm gonna do a 50-50 on the upper one. Yeah. Let's go. Bump it. Let's get it. Line prep. Because coming up here in just a couple weeks, Stoke Run is actually hosting the qualifier round. So. I took this opportunity just to get a line down and make sure I was, you know, got something under my belt. But this actually right here is where I left my GoPro. So if you guys didn't see my last video, I was talking about how I left my GoPro at Stoke Run. And sure enough, they shipped it back to me. Big old shout out to Stoke Run. You guys made all the next future videos possible. But that's going to do it here at Stoke Run. I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. If you did, give me a big old thumbs up and smash that subscribe button. And I'll catch you guys in the next one out in Arizona.